So, it's the middle of summer. Your kids have been home at least a month. They may be getting ready to go back to school. You may still be at the height of your summer vacation. And you're bored. And they're bored. And quite possibly your budget is stretched a little thin for summer activities. So what are you supposed to do with your children? Here is my ultimate science suggestion. Take your kids to a museum. Very often they're free or by donation or very low cost. There are amazing museums on the national level and on your local level. The thing that I love best about taking kids to a museum is you may not have any idea what things will capture their interest. And of course, if they haven't seen them, they don't know either. Spend the time to take your kids to see the dinosaurs and the gemstones, ancient history or art portraits, because there's science in everything. The magic of color, the cutting of stones, bone structure, archaeology, paleontology, geology, physics, chemistry, biology, all of it is present at a museum. And some of the museums, like the pictures I took this summer at the Museum of Natural History in Washington, D.C. at the Mall, have hands-on working scientists and archaeologists in the museum so your kids can see scientists at work. A lot of them maybe even have courses that you can enroll your kids in, summer science projects, things like that. But the thing is, it's something you can engage with your kids in doing. You learn something, they learn something, teenagers like it, little kids like it, adults like it. Whether you just wanna stay out of the sun or need something to do in the rain, absolutely consider a museum as a place to play science games with your kids. Have them pick something out that they like. Ask them what they would do with it, what they think it's used for, how it was invented or created. Take notes of what your kids like and go home together and look up the science or figure out the science. Also, museum gift stores are a great place to pick up a couple science experiments or at least get an idea of things that you could recreate at home. Have a great summer.